The uh, purpose of this video is to explain how to assemble this 1926 patent model carnival ride salesman sample. And Ben is here to tell us the best way to assemble this. Yes, okay, so first I started with the base, which is these four uh, beams here with the, like the central pole. They fit together, you have to have the beams laid out before you put the pole on. Um, one thing to note is that these supporting rods have to be in the right place way later in the assembly, so you wanna make sure you have the beams like oriented in this way where you have the hooks on both ends here. Once I had those in, then I put these rods up uh, and then all the supporting rods. And so at that point, it could stand on its own. And then uh, after that, you put on these uh, beams. They, slot, they slide into slots, and the slots are numbered on the central pole. Um, after you get those slots on, you want to put this big sprocket on right away. The, sp the sprocket comes in four pieces, and it hangs on these... Um, these like hook things. Um, try to get the sprocket on immediately because it's very difficult to put it on after you have everything else assembled. And then once you have the sprocket on um, and the beams on, uh, make sure that these supporting rods are in place. And then um, after you have all of that done and ready to go, then start working on the like the uh, drive assembly part of it. This goes together pretty easily. There's like hinges down here that just allow you to slot this part in. And then uh, same with this. Um, once you have this part installed, get the chain on right away. And then after that, uh, all that's left really are carts um, these little bits here that help move the carts back and forth. Um, and then uh, hooking up the motor. And uh, then these beam, these uh, supporting rods at the end that tighten it up and make sure that there's no movement of the beams here. And then that's it. Thank you, Ben.